boy No Chill Chat checking in, and I got another short video vlog for you. Um, as you all know, I did wreck my car uh, or got into a car accident, and I'm in the process of getting it all repaired. And there's a couple parts I needed, there's a couple parts I'm interested in, and there's a couple people that I wanted to link up with um, Carbon Motorsports and Woody's Customs, both out in California. So I wanted to kind of just see the products for myself. So what did I do? I took a trip to Cali. Stay tuned. All right, guys, I'm out in Cali. My first stop is the world famous Woody's. Woody's Customs, man. This guy makes some sick carbon fiber pieces, hoods, splitters, bumpers. You know, he makes all the uh, the hoods that you see people with, like red eye hoods, the ZR1 hoods for every car. You know, if you need it, you need it made, this is the man right here. So we're gonna just uh, go check out his shop in a little bit and um, just see what products he has on hand. We're gonna chop it about, chop it up, uh, try to get this hood made for the F body. Um, yeah, man, some nice pieces out here. It's definitely some nice pieces. Make sure you check out his work. It's Woody's Customs on uh, on Instagram. I'll put it down in the story. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Share this video because you're going to see some incredible work. So he does the fiberglass. He does the carbon fiber. All A1, man. Got to check this dude out. Sick work. So we're going to go in the shop in a minute, and we're going to see what he's got going on. Yo. So I get the, the original good. Yep. Original hood. And then we mold the scoop on it. So this is just like a like a regular OEM. OEM just regular yeah. hood. Okay. And then we mold the scoop. Yes. Okay. We burn the scoop onto it and then we do all the body work. So from here it goes up. Even to even it. like this one, like That's just how they come. stock base model charger hood. And then boom, you can get you a demon hood. Just like that. <laughs> That's crazy. Hoods on hoods on hoods. Real carbon weave. So now people send me fenders. This is a this is a challenger hood and I made it a a, a red eye version two with the original scoops and everything. Mm. And my mind just started going and going. Dude. That hex is crazy. Oh, we got the fenders, splitters. Track hawk. Track hawk. Track hawk red eye hood. Mirror. Mirrors. Spoiler. Side skirts coming soon. This stuff is like flawless. The weave is going one direction. It ain't switching direction. There's no seam in it. Man, that's crazy. So how many, what would you start collecting this stuff? That's my son. My that's your son? Kid, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. That's his stuff. Well, that's where it starts. Yeah. <laughs> Every kid is where it starts. Right, the 300 Forge Carbon. Ooh. Okay, the forge is nasty. I don't know, y'all like the forged? Or do y'all like, it's the, what is the hex? Or what is this called? Honeycomb. honeycomb. Or y'all like the honeycomb? I don't know, the forge is. I think the only thing with forge is like, I like it. But it's like when I see people do too much of it on the car. That's when it uh, strays. But once you go, you know, carbon, you got to match the rest of the carbon. Mm -hmm. So if you do the hood, you got to be like, just a little bit here, you know, maybe the spoiler, the lip spoiler, or can't go too overboard uh, with with the hex or the forge. Now, regular carbon, you can go overboard. Yeah, carbon everywhere. Carbon yeah, the world. I've never done a car with every single part. It's just either the hood or a couple parts. I've never done a, like a full entire car with it. 
do you plan on doing a full carbon infused car? Like I can. I have two orders. Really? Florida, yeah. They're driving their cars over. Oh my goodness. So I got two orders of those. Well, that's gonna be coming soon. You heard it here exclusive. <laughs> you wanna know anything? Oh, I see you down in there. Oh, okay, okay, okay. She's cool. Come on up. Come on up. Got you. She's like, it's too early, bro. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, man? Just want no chill chat, man. What's your name? Tony. Tony. So I heard you're the creator. You started this. Pretty much. How did it start? What was just like, you know, your thought? Uh, shit, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> He was like, oh, let me make a shifter now for my car. Oh, yeah, and then... I had a Challenger, and I just started doing interior for it because I see that there was, uh, I was a team at our team, and I see people liked it. So I was like, you know, fuck it, I could do it. I had a little knowledge of how to do it. So mm -hmm. I was like, why not? I wasn't doing much. And it kind of started. So what was your first piece? Uh, it was a dash. It right? was the dashboard? Yeah, the okay. Dashboard so you started, your first piece was a whole dashboard. Yeah. Most people start with like a, a vent. A vent. <laughs> a vent or something in the car, you know. You start with a dashboard. People don't even like to take out the dashboard. Yeah, I mean, we're at a body shop, so they ain't afraid of taking apart stuff. Yeah, like. true, true, true. And then now, where it's grown, like, are you just kind of like flabbergasted, like the level that it's grown to? I'm grateful that people like to work and people actually want it. You know, so it's. Did you expect that? Not to the extent of what it is yeah. right now. <laughs> yeah. but, you know, I'm ready for anything. Yeah. I'm not gonna slow down right now. See, I need some more hands, but it's hard to find good good work, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's hard to teach them the right way. I definitely understand that one. So, what's your project card now? I don't got one right now. No? No. Just chilling, stacking Just chilling, it up. Uh, yeah, trying to save up to next year. Get a jailbreak or something. A jailbreak. Um, <laughs> no, no jailbreak. No. Dually. No. No, it's probably just like a truck. Three F three fifty. It's a uh, Sierra. Sierra. Good choice, good choice. Diesel? Nah. No diesel? Nah. For what? No, I don't work at a rent. Diesel cheaper than the gas out here, right? Than regular gas? Yeah, but uh, I need a big ass truck. Right <laughs> Man. Because it is, it's hard to find parking. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know how you're going to fit the truck in here anyway. You're going to park it on the road. Yeah, park it outside. That's just you where we park. Is you? Okay. This bumper is a wide body charger. SRT. SRT. There's a big cutout. There's a hole missing. That's what I did notice. <laughs> On the WK1. Oh. Okay, so we're putting the back end, the vent of the wide body chargers on a WK1. So you got like that Hellcat body flow on a Jeep. That's it. That's gonna be nasty. Yeah, this is taking it, he's taking it to a whole nother level of custom. Yeah. So pretty much, even if you got a Camaro and you wanted this, you probably could get this. <laughs> right? That's why I said just about anything. Just about anything. I don't know about y'all, but a lot of people say they can do something. And it's like, oh, I can do it, I can do it, but they've never done it. But this is proof in the pudding. Like... Even everything I've already showed you to show that they literally are doing what they're saying they're doing and capable of doing. So I can't wait until this is done. I got to see this when this is done. What's the, what's the turnaround for this? About a month. A month. All right. So springtime, we're going to see this. I hope it's a fast Jeep. Is the Hellcat yeah. swapped us up? It is a fast Jeep. I'm not sure what's on the engine, but it's a, it, it's a, it's a pretty nice Jeep. So Okay. Cool. It's worth it. It's worth it. All yeah. right. <laughs> Three piece lip for the charger. Hexagon. You use her for that car in the top side. Wet. All the 300 with the V1, really. And what stage is this in? That's uh, that's the second stage we call it. And then from there it goes out to a finish stage and clear. Gotcha. And that's just buffing it out and everything like that. And then 
wet sand buff and then this is fresh. Fresh. this is just a clear coat and then we still gotta send it down and buff it so it gets smoother than this. Mm -hmm. And what's this one gonna be? So it's a red eye uh, V2 um, Dodge Charger hood. We did the red uh, carbon fiber yesterday, the red uh, honeycomb honey. Uh, let me take it out. Let okay. Me, let me flip it around. You wanna, let me go on the other side. You wanna help me? Okay. Put it down. So this is the ZR1 hood for the Trailblazer Super Sport. Trailblazer SS. That's the hood for the Chevy SS sedan. A Chevy SS ZR1 hood. Ooh, that's gonna be nasty. And then that's the ZL1 hood for a Trailblazer Super Sport. Trailblazer with the car hood and C6. ZL6. That's a ZL6 for a Trailblazer. Another one. WK1 Demon Hood. WK1 Demon Hood on the. The SRT Jeep, the first one, WK1. Dang. Chrysler 300 V2 Charger. Hoods galore. Kyle Hood for a Mustang. Yeah. 65 <laughs> Mustang. What, and so what'd you have to do on this hood? You created the cow? They, they brought me this hood to do cover fiber overlay. Gotcha. Okay, okay. Carly 300, you man. And again, you gotta make it flow. You can just cut it. Mm, in look at that. So y'all don't notice that. That's the details. Still has that flow here with the demon hood. That flow is so pretty. Burning creation. That's uh, WK2, Red Eye V2. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So SRT Jeep, mm -hmm. track Red Eye, Track Hog, mm -hmm. Red with Eye. The v, with the V2. Yeah. Everything Hold works. Hold level. Nice. Work. Original vents. All three of them. And I gave it a little cow hood on it so it looks more aggressive. That's what I was noticing. I was like, the cow was, was sat a little bit taller. Yeah, if you see on the original, this flows back down. Mm -hmm. But I try to go a little more aggressive on those because there's nothing for those cars like this. And there's a cow hood, but it has none of this. Mm -hmm. So I say, you know what, let me make it right. You hear this? He's just like, yo, let me make it better. Let me show you how it's supposed to be done. All right, I appreciate the time with his customs in the house. West Coast, H-Town checking in. He's got some work to do, but I appreciate his time. He's giving me a lot of knowledge, a lot of products. Make sure y'all check him out. You're going to see his IG posted at the bottom. Man, this is it. All right, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit him up if you need anything made. A lot of Mopar stuff, Chevy stuff. Of course, we got some things in the works. Got a couple ideas, and we're going to see if we can make those things happen. Uh... Once again, like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what else you want to see next on my next vlog, next reviews. Trying to get this car fixed and, you know, got my event coming up. Hit me up, guys, on IG. Shout out, slide in my DM. Let me know, you know, what you want to see, man. Thank you for your time. We out. I need to go catch this flight.